right, so we have six eggs and half a bag of sharp cheddar. You can use whatever cheese you prefer. We're gonna go ahead and give those eggs a nice little scramble. Ooh, this is gonna be so good, you guys. I'm using a big bowl here so we can get this nice and mixed super fast. Oh yeah. I don't know about you guys, but I love some cheesy eggs. But of course, we need some protein added to this. So I have some Jimmy Dean sausage and I grabbed the sage sausage because I like the extra seasoning in mine. And we are gonna use a good amount of this already cooked sausage. I don't think we're gonna use all of it, maybe about half of the package. Beautiful, and you can save that rest for tomorrow's breakfast. Go ahead and give that a nice mix. Oh yeah, this is gonna be so good. I mean, this is gonna be the perfect breakfast. It's only gonna be four ingredients. So we have one more ingredient that's really gonna pull these together. But obviously egg, cheese, and sausage are breakfast staples that everyone will love. But like, just like with the cheese, you can use any cheese and you can use any breakfast meat. You could use ham, you could use bacon, but for today we're doing the sausage. And I especially love the Jimmy Dean sage sausage because it gives you that extra flavor. So you can keep it for ingredients and not have to worry about seasoning. Mm, it smells delicious. All right, now for our fourth and final ingredient, I have some Bisquick mix. This is the original, not the pancake mix. And we are gonna add about a cup of this into our batter to make the most delicious breakfast batter. That looks like a cup to me. That was your fourth ingredient. Yeah. Are you ready for this? Yeah, so four ingredients, it's that easy. We have six eggs, half a bag of cheese, half a package of cooked sausage, and one cup of Bisquick. That's how easy it is. I bet you have all these ingredients already in your kitchen and you're gonna make a boring traditional breakfast into something fun that your kids will want to eat every morning. And it's so great for back to school because you just throw these ingredients together. You can even do it the night before and you'll have a delicious breakfast. Look at that yummy batter. That's how we want it to look, okay? But there's a lot of dry ingredients. Oh, you got it. Oh yeah. Never mind. disregard. It's almost there. Oh my goodness. Now, if you want more cheese, you could obviously add more cheese. If you want more sausage, you can add more sausage. Make it to your like, liking or else you won't like it. <laughs> All right, but this looks incredible to me. So we are actually gonna go ahead and grab a muffin tin here. And then we don't want this to stick, so I'm gonna spray it with my Pam butter. You can use regular butter if you don't like Pam. Spray those, beautiful. Go ahead and grab a ice cream scooper and we are gonna add one scoop to each of our muffin cups. Oh yeah, these are gonna be good, you guys. And that egg is just gonna let that biscuit cook. And then we have that delicious cheese that's gonna melt in there. And then that flavorful sage sausage. I mean, what is not to like? Oh yeah, okay. Just get these filled up about three fourths of the way. All right, so I ended up taking some from the others and putting it in our final one so we can get a full 12 and they look beautiful. My oven is set to 350 and these are gonna cook for 18 to 20 minutes. So fast. I know. Oh my, I wish you guys could smell these. They smell so good. Oh, wow. Okay, let's go ahead and pop a few of these out. They should just come right out. Oh, oh, they're perfect. Do you see how perfectly cooked they are? Okay, we are ready for our brunch. Honey wants a little bit. She can maybe have a, a little crumb or two. Oh, yeah. look at that bottom. Okay, I'm so excited. Wait, aren't there onions in here? Nope, no onions. Oh, disregard. Just sausage, cheese, eggs, and bisquick. Four ingredients, and you got the yummiest, easiest breakfast for back to back to school or whatever you want to make it for. Okay, let's. How many are you eating? Well, I'm, I got some for you, for me, for my sister, for Kyra. Like we have, we have people over there. Right? Oh, they look good though. Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and try one. I'm gonna cut one open. Let's cut this one. Oh yeah, you see that steam? Wow. 
That is perfectly cooked. Okay, let me cut myself a little piece to eat. And you know what? A little syrup would be really good on this. Or you could use maple bacon. Like, the options are endless. Hot sauce? Oh yeah, hot sauce. I love that idea. I'm gonna keep it four ingredients though. Okay. That's good. Mm, mm, mm. That is my favorite breakfast yet.